What's up guys, this is the Roverman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the Ottoman Empire. So to round off where we left off, I am using this force under Ahmed City to attack the Russian city of Crimea in order to um, join our front line somewhat so we can more deliberately focus on driving north towards Moscow and the northern Russian territories in order to then swing west and secure the regions of Lithuania and Belarus. But in order to do that, we first have to take Crimea. So let's let us attack. So they do have the garrison has two units. There is a force of about three units outside the city, and there is also a army in the port of Sevastopol, which will be marching to the aid of the city. My, my desk is jiggling around so much I need to drink some of this coffee. So. I'm probably going to march my howitzers up to about here. So let's take um, two units of um, Nizam infantry and the unit of grenadiers on one flank. Let's pick up unit of Nizam, Janissaries and Sereli for the left flank. Let's group the Janissary riflemen out on the right. It's got a bit more room to play with. Let's spread out our melee infantry. Our howitzers are ready to move up. Whoa, our howitzers are ready to move up. And our Royal Mameluke Guard units are going to be split up on each flank. General in the centre. Ah, so the Russian... This one, fl one uh, reinforcing army is coming in dire directly on the right. Let's form up our infantry. Let's firstly. Looks like they are setting up. Uh, looks like they are going to fall back and rejoin. Which is fine. It gives us a bit of freedom to move up. Put a pikeman on the right for support. Semat centre right. Pikeman left. I can see their cavalry charging. Mamelu guard charge to intercept. I'm going to run my melee infantry up. Let's intercept their cavalry. Well, they're actually the rest of their force is running as well. Support the battle, pikemen. Don't fire. I need, the, I need our Mamluk guards to beat the cavalry alone. I might even pivot, start pivoting these flank companies. I run that way, so when I turn these guys on to fire at will.
so that's the regiment of foot. Charge them in the flank. Keep running around with some of my cavalry. Push the pikemen. Limber the artillery. It's a reasonable field of fire. So Mamluk guards are doing some good work. Pikemen. Oh, thank God for that. Charge on. Although I suspect. Pikeman, no, 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 no. Everyone run the hell away. Line infantry charging them down, that's good. Line infantry alone, I can understand. These Mamluk guards need to get the hell out of dodge to have left them in the crossfire. So we pour fire onto this line infantry. Fire round shot this infantry. So the bulk of the enemy's effort is the reinforcements are coming in towards the right. Charge their pikemen with my pikemen. I want to try and force the left in order to swing this flank around. Yeah, we are losing, we're at risk of losing a. My riflemen are being exposed to massed musketry, which obviously I don't want. Because they are just skirmishes. Set the 55th and get my pikes in there. Militia coming in. Oh, my howitzers haven't even, haven't even unlimited my howitzers. They just sat there doing nothing. Support my poor Mamluk guards with my pikemen. Quick climb. No 
killed enemy general. Let's make sure my cavalry is interdicting every possible unit that can be shattered. I don't think there's any more reinforcements coming. Nope, they've been... Aha, there is some. Past that complete unit, shattered, 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 routing. I suppose that wants to go for really. Pikemen are coming in. Oh, Artillery's being shot at somehow. Deploy my general's bodyguard. Make sure guard mode's off. We may as well chase these guys down. And they have been slaughtered. Damn right, we're going to continue. There are still troops to shatter. No, oh, no there aren't, not anymore. Well, our current troops have been shattered. Well, their current troops have been shattered. So just focus on mopping up, I suppose. Yes. That wasn't a close victory. That was a solid, solid smashing of the Russians. Look at that. We lost 461, they lost 3,114. Obviously the Mamluk Guards and my Zemandari pikemen are up top, but some, some of my line infantry boosted experience. The Mamluk Guards went from 2 to 4, but they lost 68 men, so they're not going to hold on to that. Yep. They've been defeated... There's another army, so I'm tempted to not push in order to give this guy... You should probably march south. We are gathering more men, but it will take some time. But at least we are converting the population. So we've got this army, but they're replenishing. Yeah, took the Crimea. Technology's coming along okay. Could do with more gentlemen, but. Say la vie. I do obviously need to take care of. Get ready to take care of the damn Dagestanis. Obviously, we are pushing on all other fronts. Okay, let's hit end turn. As my spies continue to drive forward. See, they want really good tech for not necessarily as good tech. No. What? Oh, Miss Army needs... No, it doesn't need replenishment. It doesn't need replenishment, but it will bring in, like, every army they've got. No. I mean, I'll think I'll do that because there's, you know, there's much, much less danger. Much less danger there that uh, that we'll find ourselves overwhelmed and destroyed. This way, it gives us quite a nice opportunity to pick apart and destroy a small contingent of the enemy forces.
Mm, so this was it. Uh, because this is an important front, I'm just going to let them come at me. Unless, of course, they do anything silly, in which case then I will push out and, and uh, go offensive. Hmm. I haven't had an audio problem for a while there, so unsurprisingly, one had to show up. Okay, I think there. Obviously, deploying against the red line can be very dangerous. Because if you, your men rout, then they will disappear instantly. My oh, round shot doesn't do any good. But let's just speed up time just to let my artillery do work against the enemy guns. Especially as they seem to be marching towards us in clump formation. And they've deployed stakes the wrong way. Don't waste your time against that artillery piece because they're not even firing with them anymore. Those are the marines? It is the marines. Quick climb inbound. Probably on the cavalry. One on the cavalry, one on the marines. One unit keep working on the marines, another unit work on the line infantry guards. And because right now we're just going to artillery the hell out of them as they get close. Ah, that single gun has started firing again. Just gonna let the cavalry just keep pushing in. And let the artillery just keep doing the doing the business. Let's take this flank like so. Realistically, just let my uh, just let the quick climb do as much damage as possible. Yeah, smash the Hungarian fusiliers. You hit the line infantry guards. Cavalry is going to hop in and mop up any uh, any infantry that actually makes it to our lines. Come the first. First, something or other regiment. Karlstadt, the cancer. Okay, let's make sure our guns are still. How is are firing at non? Non-dangerous target. Well, not non-dangerous, but that's the wrong word. Yeah, there goes enemy general. So we're going to work our way 
Left to right. Shattering their troops. Our guns can get back onto the job of destroying their artillery. You guys can just stop shooting, really. The idea is just to uh, shatter as many men as can be found. We will take some casualties. Somehow it's just to shoot at the back even though they can't hit them because that's going to happen. Shattered. Go hit the marines. Shattered. Okay. Shattered. 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 Let's get my cavalry back out of the way. Realistically, I need that unit to be destroyed with a musket fire. Oh, they're already shattered. Okay. Artillery, keep pounding away the bank. Now I'm going to speed up time. Guards have been hit. Grenadiers get involved. If we can gang up on this this dragoon unit. And take them out before these guys re either reload or get back involved. Sakers have been shattered. So is the horse artillery. So it's just this guy now. They all, they too are shattered. Good. Everything is shattered. We have absolutely destroyed their force with very few losses on our side. That's exactly what we want to see. No. Auto. Damn, we lost a lot more men there to kill a handful of theirs. Well, just goes to show, can't trust the auto resolve. I really do need to start. Okay, I need to divert the force that's gone to hit Comey to go intercept some of those forces because they will take it back and it's not the end of the world if they do this is part of the reason why we are building our building our um, putting more forces up inside Turkey itself they're going to go hit uh, Moldova yeah, we need to we need to expand our army. Still, still we need to expand our army, despite the large expansion that's already happened. But that's uh, that's total war for you, especially against on such a wide front against so many major powers. That's kind of what you need to do, really. So I don't really know. Well, Morocco has been booted out of. Uh, well, whoever owned Morocco has been booted out. Got another assassin. Um, except this time you're going to go up to 
Berlin, I suppose. New town emerges in Don Voisco. Craft workshop. So he is going to go attack Moldavia. I cannot currently intercept anything. This guy needs to hit Herman Peters. The loss of a thousand men. And then you guys march to there. You can start to be backed up. You're going... Ah, yes, you're going to support this new army. Get these chaps up on the front line to be replenished. Kiev, stable. I'm going to send these guys out to attack the remaining garrison, although that's quite depleted already. Okay, so you move up to here. You push. Mm, not to get there quick enough. Well, you can't get there quick enough, so you may as well demand the surrender of the town. May as well make you march in this direction. Yeah, Crimea's a bit unhappy, but if we don't tax them, they'll get over it. You do need to be destroyed. The Kiev army is being replenished. Okay. So, traits gained. Lots of good stuff. Agent detected, so you've been thrown out of there. Cobble roads in Kiev. Keep spending the money in Bushrika. You get the roads and get a fur exchange. You get craft workshop. This army may have to be directed back south again, which if they do, that's okay. Let's make sure we're not upgrading anything here, such as the mine. Let's cancel this. Because we're about to lose Kazan, so we're going to lose that mine, so we may as well not upgrade it. Don't upgrade this mine, because they're still within range. These men need to hold up, need to be ready again. The nation rises Morocco. Is there anyone I can trade with? Dagestan still, they don't want to trade. Yeah, lots of recruitment. Imperial Engineers School. Happiness across the board. Speaking of really, I do need to build two first rate ships of the line. Coffee house, don't worry. Looking for good, quick wins around industry building. Coffee houses are fine, but I'm not so bothered about happiness. There we go. Successful missions. These are all the guys who got spying on people. Ahmed City took Crimea, so that's good, good stuff. Obviously, we took Komi. Okay. Let's spend a bit more cash on this chap. Let's get a unit of Samat Janissaries. And let's get him a unit of Nizam Light Infantry.
Okie dokie, let's hit end turn. Not my spy got assassinated. Ideally, I do not want the Mughals to attack me. The Austrians can raid to their heart's content. I just want to make sure they don't cause too much trouble. Please block your smaller army from crossing over the river. That would be hilarious. Looks like they might send, uh, send some shit ships around to try and blockade me. Oh no, they're raiding the Spanish. Mm, the Russians keep rebelling. We do need to, we do need to intercept that Russian army and destroy it. The speeds of what for whatever reason. Oh no, there must there must be a war with Spain. But we need to keep our conversion machine rolling on. Keep our imams move pushing forward, converting everyone. Agent executed. Fair enough. New town emerges in Bashrika. Okay, I'm gonna build a madrasa to spawn to try spawn more priests, or at least I can make, move this priest on. Komi build a governor's residence, and you guys can march south. Yeah, they won't hate us for too long. Let's build dirt roads. You can march on about that, sort of that direction. Priests are continuing to march onwards. Let's knock down the smith to build a madrasa. I'm going to build that just to stop it from showing up. I should probably upgrade this into a global trading company. To be honest, lots of my panels, lots of my ports should be really. They're a big money sink but damn they produce a lot of money. So we've got lots of raids. Russia and Prussia are now at war. For what good it'll do them. Crimea's on strike. And then not anymore. Upgrades and mills. See I've just built that and now I'm knocking it down. <laughs> lots of recruitment in Turkey. Gotta keep growing. Let's take my fleet as it currently is. Drop them out to Heracleon. In order to have our th my fleet stationed a bit more in the direction of threat. Let's take these chaps that I see to go hit Yadimir Kovalenko. But, looking at the timer, I believe it's time to win the episode. So, thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for the destruction of another Russian fleet. Not fleet, army. Cheers everyone.